this video i am talking about basic structure of pseudo classes like first child last child and only child so these are very useful for selecting the list items and other elements like which are in the lines like paragraph anchors and some other elements so you can use this like so i will also show you render view so this is i have an unordered list which i am going to give the example so let's back to texture editor and you can i will also show you basic default styling i will apply to some elements so let's start i am first showing you example of first child so this is very nice so i am selecting the first list item with command first child so uh, now which i give the styling it applies on the first list item so i will change the background to coral no i think sky blue it's good and i will also change the color of font so i will it change to white so this is very nice combination of colors so refresh and now you can see it was now looking very good and this time it selected the first list item so it is same the last child so in the at this time it selects the last list item of our unordered list so now all the all the styling applies on last list item so you can see here i will also change the border bottom to it i will give it to none so now border of bottom it goes and it never now appeared so you can see that's very useful so next is the only child so this is very uh, useful property or child so remember it is very useful tag and i will show you example so first i will so type here only child and give some styling to it and i will give the i will change the background to coral and now again go to browser and refresh and now you can see all the stylings have been changed and it now selecting the for a only child which is ul and what is looking for only child only child go, going to body and it looks which is only a child so here inside body here's a an order list which is only child so if i will here give a, another tag like h1 so there is now sibling and the this the color is now can't work like so now our background is no more because the h1 tag is sibling to ul so after this i'm sh showing you another example like i will here an add another tag bold to sibling inside h1 here close it and now again if i go to browser and refresh now you can see here background is again now applies to sibling word so that's because now our only child going and they are looking for only child element inside of body so here it goes to h1 and see here body is uh, sorry bold is only child so if i apply some more tags here of bold or any other you can use like span and any other so again i will open browser and refresh and now our second of our second list items second word is now background changed so if i here add another tag like span and close it and now if i go to browser and refresh and you can see sibling background color is no more because the span tag is sibling to h1 sorry to bold and that's because so i have i will show you another another example if i here type span so you can see i will want delete this bold and now you can see here the background applies to ul inside uh, inside of span 
so it not applies to bold because I will select the hair to span if I hair change to B like bold so it now applies on second because or it now applies on bold tag so this is the difference between first child last child and only child if you have any question please comment and please thanks for watching and subscribe my channel